In this tutorial, I will show you how to turn images into 3D models with Google's Nano Banana AI. At the end of the video, I threw in a bonus tip that will instantly elevate your work to the next level. All prompts I use in this video are in the description below. I'm gonna create a domed earth home. Type in domed earth home in the desert. There are circular windows and the home has two stories and some rooms. Aerial drone shot, high quality architecture rendering. Hold control and press enter. Now that we have our image created, we want Nano Banana to delete all the landscaping. So that way when we put it in the image to 3D model generator, it doesn't create the landscaping as well. Let's tell Nano Banana to remove the landscaping. I want you to remove the entirety of the landscaping so that the building is just a simple 3D model with no background. Hold control and press enter. The hardest part about writing a good prompt is knowing what you want. Linked in the description below is the ultimate Nano Banana Cheat Sheet. It's a complete Nano Banana prompting guide made specifically for architecture. It's even got professional prompts already written for you. All you have to do is fill in the blanks. After that's done, download the image. Open a new tab, search for Meshi AI. Click into the Meshi AI website. After you've created an account, head over to Workspace at the top, hover over it, and do Image to 3D. If you would like to pay for Meshi, you can actually do Batch Images to 3D, where you can insert multiple images of the building from different angles to create a more accurate 3D model. I'm not going to go over it here, but you're more than welcome to try that if you would like to. It creates a much more accurate 3D model. But as for now, let's head over to Image to 3D, click in this box, and upload your image. Make sure Auto is selected under Symmetry, and click Generate. On the right-hand side, you can see that currently Meshi is generating the 3D model. Click the box to open it. Scribe through the boxes to rotate the 3D model and find which one you like the most. This bottom left one seems to be the most accurate. I'm going to select it and choose Yes for Generate Texture. Confirm. Now on the right-hand side, you can see that it's generating the texture for us. When the texture generation is complete, you can click it, and now you have your 3D model. Thank you for watching until the end. In the description of this video is a link to the Nano Banana Cheat Sheet made specifically for architecture. It contains hundreds of words and several pre-made prompts that will instantly elevate your work to the next level. If you like the video, please like the video and subscribe down below if you want to see future content just like this. If you want to support the channel further, check out the Patreon. It's linked in the description below. Thanks for watching.